giving so much power to money and fame. No one famous ever changed my life. When I was in Watts, I was born and raised in Martin Luther King Hospital. I moved out of Watts when I was 18, and I ain't moved far. I moved to Hawthorne, El Segundo, and Van Ness. But I was in the hood every day. You know, you can't leave the hood. You just see you hooked. But at the end of the day, this right here, this is a direct reflection of everyone in this room recognizing your actual power. I want y'all to understand that it may, it may feel like other people have a bigger voice because they may be on TV, mm -hmm. but the folks that's on TV are not here. In order to get Prophet Walker in this position for state assembly, it's gonna take real people like you that's decided, yeah. I have a problem with what's going on in this community. And I may not have all the money in the world, I may not be famous, but I have a voice and I can affect change because I recognize the power that I have. I recognize the influence that I have. And that's what this is about. So I cannot tell you all enough that in my mind, there is literally no difference in me and you. Because guess what? It doesn't matter how many fans I may have around the world, I can only vote one time. <laughs> right? Think about this. Everybody in this room makes that vote even more impactful because I can't say because I'm famous, I can vote 30 times. I can only vote one time. So if you're going to vote that one time and we're going to influence this community to vote that one time for Prophet Walker, just hold up one finger right here. Yeah. And while you're holding up that one finger, we're saying to God be the glory. And we recognize that with God, all things are possible. Yes, and we recognize the power of our individual force, execution, and getting in these streets. Oh, and even if they don't know, we're going to make them aware that if you have a problem oh, with what's going on in this community, with this one finger pointing up to God, we don't want no credit. We're here to do God's work. We're foot soldiers right. yeah. doing right. God's work. So. Be, have that conviction when you walk up to these doors today and get them to vote. Have that conviction to make, I don't know nothing about no politics. Cool. I don't either. But guess what? <laughs> I, do know, I do know that when my brother went to jail, he got out and couldn't find a job. He rededicated his life to God. He recognized his mistake. He got it and couldn't find a job. I do know that there's this racial profiling and people that's just getting attacked and thrown in jail for just stupid reasons oh, because one of the top growing businesses in America is the prison business. Mm -hmm. The prison business is more profitable than any other business in America right now. Oh, so I want y'all to understand that beyond anything else, the fact that y'all are here, y'all have decided that you have a problem with what's going on in Compton Watts in our community and we're here to make a difference. And I'm here, I'm here. I slept in my car last night. Right. I slept in my car last night. I went to Ross. I mean, to Marshall. I went to Marshall. I'm gonna show you. Y'all think I'm playing? Hold on. What does my shoe say? What does that say? It says Ross. Thirty-two dollars. I went and bought me some shoes. Fly though, friend. Take this very serious. I'm fully committed to this. Prophet Walker, baby. We in it. Woo!